Good morning. My name's Professor Stilton Cocktoo Smart. And I'd like to welcome you to a splendid day out. So Rob, what's happening today? Well today is the first three-day weekender of a splendid day out, a Victorian and steampunk festival that we're hoping to bring to Morecambe as a long-lasting festival. We had a, a marvellous music night last night at the Hot House in Morecambe called the Kraken Night Out. That went terrifically well. And today we, we have an indoor artisan market, outdoor events, entertainment and a jolly good time. You name it, we've probably got it. And if we don't have it, it's under the table. You're looking at probably one of the most eclectic movements there is. Steampunk arrived as a response to costume play in the States where people suddenly realised there was a rich variety of Victorian science fiction. Captain Nemo, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, H.G. Wells, The Time Machine. All that was wonderful, and it was how the Victorians were dealing with science fiction that kick-started it all off. It's not entirely science fiction, but it is a way of dressing in magnificent attire, behaving magnificently, Manners are always to the fore here. Splendidness is to the fore. There are only two rules. Be nice and be splendid. We set up a local group called the League of Splendid. Essentially to take part, we're using it as a vehicle to try and bring steampunk to the Victorian town of Morecambe. The people who come here, well, they're just like you and me, to tell you the truth. Bankers, they're engineers, retired people, young people, older people. It is actually one of the few real family oriented lifestyle choices you can make. Most of the guys here will be going home for Monday morning to go back to work. We had people at the Kraken Night Out last night, over 70 years old, dressed magnificently, bopping away to really great tunes. They are ordinary people who have an interest in the extraordinary and they'll dress up and it's a way of expressing themselves in a really unique manner. We are looking backwards to go forwards. The complex name is Retrofuturism. But we don't use that, we just have a damn good time. Victorian resort. Morecambe was invented by the Victorians and we were looking around at one of the steampunk events we went to a couple of years ago and thought wow this is brilliant it was our first one but we could do it better. Morecambe is the ideal place. It is a tolerant town believe it or not. It's had punk festivals, it's had scooter festivals, it's had loads of stuff but it hasn't had Victorians and it hasn't had steampunk. So what better place than to hold a steampunk festival other than in a, a Victorian railway station, in a Victorian seafront. This is the ideal town. What we're aiming to do is bring Morecambe to life in an entirely different way by reflecting its past and connecting it with where it's going in Morecambe but for Steampunk and Victoriana. Sounds absolutely splendid. Rob, thank you very much. You're very welcome. welcome.